something just happened to me that has never happened to me in my nursing career. And okay. So I was seeing a patient for the first time, never saw this patient before. I'm doing a follow up for another nurse. This patient is an elderly man who has dementia. That's it. He lives in a facility on the facility. There's like a Catholic church on the, on the premises. So he was at church when I arrived and they're like, but he's going to be back any minute. We'll bring him to you when he comes here. I'm like, great. Talking to the nurse, anything, any updates, anything you need me to know, any refills you need, yada, yada. He comes in, he gets wheeled in from church. The second he sees me, his eyes light up and he's like, oh my gosh, I can't believe this. You've come to see me. I'm so excited. And at first I'm like, I'd never seen this person before. So I was just like, oh my gosh, how wonderful. Thank you. Yes, I've come to see you. And I introduced myself. I'm Julie. I'm your nurse. I've come to check up on you and see how you're doing. How are you feeling? You know? And he's like, oh, I cannot believe you're here. Oh, what a treat. What a treat. I'm so excited. I can't believe you come to see me. And now I'm starting to understand that this man thinks I'm definitely someone else. He does not think I'm the nurse despite me saying I'm your nurse. But he was so happy and so pleasant and so sweet that I'm like, I am not going to, I'm just going to go with this. He's not being mean and that's fine. So I was just like, oh my gosh, of course. How are you? How are you feeling? I'm going to check you out just for a second. I just want to make sure you're doing okay. Sure. So I'm starting to do my assessment and he just keeps going on looking at me. His eyes are like welling up. He's like, I cannot believe you're here. I love you. I can't believe you're here. What a treat. I'm so excited. Wow, this is such a treat. I wasn't expecting this today. <laughs> Again, I don't know who this man thinks I'm is, who I am, but I'm I'm not going to be like I'm the nurse. You know, so I just was like, "Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. You're so happy. Like I love you too." I said it. I was like, "I don't know what I'm going to I said I love you too." <laughs> because I don't know. What else? I'm not going to try to reiterate to this man with dementia that he's confused. I mean, clearly he's having some kind of nice thing happening and I'm not going to stop that. So I just said, thank you so much. I love you too. I'm so happy to see you too. And then by the end of the visit, he was so sweet. I said, I'll see you again. He said, oh, thank you so much. I'm going to pray for you. Thank you. I'll pray for you too, sir. And I left. He was so nice. I don't know who he thought I was. Like, part of me does feel sad and bad about it. But also, like, whoever he thought I was, he was very happy to see me. And that made me happy. So, that's happened before with dementia patients, but not this much. Where he was clearly, like, moved to see me. Whoever it was that he thought I was. And I just kind of went with it. Love you guys.